So I was scrolling through Twitter and then I see Kamestar saying this, breaking Logan Paul against Mayweather announced. I was like, no, 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 no. This might be, this has to be a troll. So then I go to Mayweather's Instagram page and it's actually true. Can you goddamn believe it? Uh, what qualifies some amateur who had one fight and lost to a guy who was not even a good boxer fight the best boxer of all time? Not just a one, no, no, not one of the best, the best boxer of all time, in my opinion. And just to even triple check, this is not a troll. TMZ Sports is reporting on it. The Zone is reporting on it. <laughs> this is actually happening. I wonder how much. Logan Paul is going to get paid for this. I, f I feel like Mayweather's just bored and needs money. Because, you know, he did a fake fight against N Nawaz... What the hell was his name? Nazukawa? No. <laughs> Ten Tension Na Nazukawa. Uh, it was a fake fight. Just go go see it. Tension was uh, paid to take a dive, obviously. He also fought McGregor. McGregor is a great UFC fighter. And he's a good boxer for MMA. Even as a regular boxer, is pretty good. But obviously not of the caliber of a 50-0 professional boxer. And it's not 50-0 with Trumps. It's 50-0 against incredible fighters. If we go to BoxRec.com and look at... The type of people that he's fought. Andrew Berto, Pacquiao, Maidana, Twice, Canelo, Guerrero, Cotto, Ortiz, Shane Mosley, De La Hoya, Hatton, Zab Judah. All of these guys are super strong. And if we go to Unboxing Rex rankings, Lloyd is second. The last time you checked he was once. I don't know why they put this guy as first. He has 25 losses. But just to tell you that he's so good. Alvarez is probably the best boxer at the moment. And I think that's what Box Rec, yeah, Box Rec says that Saul Alvarez is the best boxer at the moment and Floyd absolutely obliterated him someone who moves like this and destroys professional fighters should not be fighting amateurs some people are gonna say oh, it's good for boxing it brings mainstream attention to boxing I just think it makes boxing a spectacle it makes it a circus it's silly it's just like it's like if GSP was fighting the other Paul Jake Paul not Logan Paul it would make MMA a circus it's ridiculous it's dumb but anyways now this goddamn douche Logan is gonna make even more money. Isn't it incredible how some of the dumbest people, some of the most immoral people in society are the ones who are millionaires and they just keep getting more money? So we don't have much details for now. We know that it's an exhibition on pay-per-view. I'm not gonna pay for that. We don't have the rules for the exhibition. When we look at stats, Logan Paul is 25, 0-1. Logan Paul is much bigger though. He is six foot two and 200 pounds. Floyd is 5'9 at 157. This doesn't matter. This absolutely does not matter, I tell you. Floyd is going to massacre Logan Paul. <laughs> he is going to laugh at him, massacre him, do everything he wants with him. This is going to be much worse than Conor McGregor. Conor can fight. I don't like Conor McGregor. I think Conor McGregor is overrated in the UFC, but he can fight. And he can certainly box. Tension is real good, but he obviously wasn't trying. He was paid to, to lose. But yeah, so now we have the Paul brothers infiltrating boxing. It's annoying as hell. Jake fought on the undercard of Mike Tyson and Roy Jones Jr. He knocked out a dude, uh, an NBA player, Nate Robinson, who could not fight at all. Not at all. He fought worse than some guys that I sparred with at the gym who sparred for the first time in their lives. Like, honestly, I've never seen someone being so horrible at boxing. And if you're curious about me, I started doing kickboxing at 13 and did MMA after that for a few years. So I'm involved in the fighting community. These YouTube girls better find some Barbie dolls to play with because I'm not the one for the kid games. Three years ago, a fighter from the USC said my name and I had to put a muzzle on that bitch. Looking Paul can get the same treatment before I go conquer Japan again. Yeah, Floyd, amazing boxer, not the smartest guy around. But anyways, he's going to destroy that young punk. Hopefully he knocks him out cold, but I don't think so. I think he's just going to stop him like he stopped McGregor. All right, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.